Hi guys, so welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, we are doing another skincare review. But this time, I just realized I have been doing a lot of like luxury skincare products, uh, which is great and everything, but I think I also don't wanna make an impression that like only luxury skincare products are good and that's what you should be just using. Uh, but I think there are actually so many drugstore products that actually have equally the similar effect probably not exactly the same but it can do the same job that i want to tell you guys about so this time i'm going to be talking about ami skincare this is a very very affordable skincare product that is available at target i think they're originally from uk but now you know they are available in the us uh, through target so okay one thing I love about this brand, uh, first of all, I have had them uh, for a couple of weeks now. Uh, they are eco-friendly, so their entire packaging it says it in here then as well that like uh, it is all recyclable and everything. So that is really good. And other thing I love about is that they have really uh, distinctively separated their lines based on your uh, skin uh, requirement, I guess. So because these three products that I have here, this is, oops, uh, this is mostly um, like normal to dry skin, but there are actually other products that they have in the line. I will throw up like pictures right here. There is something for oily skin. There is something for like if you want your skin to be more glowy and so that's what it is for. So it's essentially like three lines uh, that's divided by them. So I think that is so smart. I think most of the time there are so many brands that like they have products, but they don't necessarily say it right on the top of the like what is this for like we are kind of confused it's like you have to read like fine details and sometimes i have to like go into like a little more deets and like is this for normal skin is this for dry skin like what is it so it right here that's for normal to dry skin okay first we just start with the cleansing balm so almost all of the products actually have like very similar um like ingredients i mean in the same line so this one is made out of uh almond milk and safflower. I don't think I've ever seen any brand that's using almond milk for that, so that's pretty interesting. So because this is considered a cleansing balm, uh, so it can be used as a part of your double skincare, double cleansing routine. And most people who are double cleansing, they, you know, take off their makeup or sunscreen with the balm, then afterwards they use a cleanser. But because this already has aqua, like water in it, so you don't necessarily have to use a water-based cleanser afterwards. I know some people do it with double cleansing, but this is not required at all. So you can just use this one as to take off your makeup or sunscreen uh, and that's it. You don't have to cleanse it again. So let me just show you guys the texture. So yeah, it's pretty um, like balm-like but it's also like I'm pretty sure when this is mixed in with water um, it is very um, you know cleanse like one thing I will also say almost all of the products so they do have fragrance in it so I don't want to give you guys the impression that this is fragrance free uh, it's one thing I love about it also I'm gonna zoom in right here again to show you guys if you guys see right here that they really broke it down in terms of what they are because as a normal consumer we are we have like no idea what these are sometimes but they really just said it like what it, it's like plants the fragrance whatever so they really are like saying it that like oh it's plant it's water or it's just coconut i think that is really really helpful i love this about this brand and even in the bottom they're giving information about recycling that like you know uh we take care of our skin we also want to look after our planet so uh, i just love that it's so cute so the second product we're going to talk about is the exfoliator uh this one is called exfoliating polish so exfoliator is just generally uh, it's not something i would use on a regular day i would recommend more like two times a week max three times a week it really depends uh, because i have a sensitive skin um 
I would use it like maybe once, twice max a, a week. So you would be fine with that. Um, so this one also to have the same ingredient, almond milk and safflower. Uh, it says like it removes the dead skin cells, uh, which is essential what the most exfoliators do. Um, one thing I just don't like with sometimes some exfoliators is that like it's very harsh. So let's test it out to see how it is. Uh, one thing I will also say, all of, almost all of these are uh, natural not 100% but very close to it it's like 98 95 percent so that's really cool that they are mentioning it as well um, so let me just show. okay so this is another thing is that like it's not this is not like a regular exfoliator um, it has a little bit of the texture of a uh, exfoliation that you know you would get like that charcoal not charcoal like like that stone like uh, it's not even stone like it's just kind of like not smooth texture which is normal for exfoliator uh, so another thing i wanted to also mention is that like every single one of their products they are saying this is that it's dermal dermatologist approved so that's something i learned from tiktok and i want to mention too is that like there are sometimes for products i have seen so many of them actually it just says dermatologist tested that doesn't necessarily mean that dermatologist is approving this product and telling you that you can use it so when it says dermatologist tested yeah dermatologist tested but they are not necessarily saying you should buy this but when it says dermatologist approved so that means this is a good product and dermatologist actually approved it so this really says it in all of their products and lastly we have this moisturizer so one thing i would say from the regular packaging i really just thought this was a serum uh, or the toner or something like that because this doesn't really look like a regular moisturizer but yes this is the moisturizer again it has the same almost very similar ingredients almond milk safflower. flower so it just really just helps with the moisturizing your skin so like it locks the moisture for 24 hours and it says helps with the skin's bounciness um, that's to determine I will test it out later um, let me just also show you guys the texture I just love this kind of packaging because it's easier that you don't uh, tend to use too much when it's tube you end up using way more than you should but this one you don't it is very soft um, I love that and again almost all of them smell the same there is a little bit of a fragrance in it but I would say it's not lingering or anything so it doesn't particularly bother me so yeah i would not say it's bad at all so anyways so these are all three products uh, they sent me i know i think there's one more product in this line which is like face wipes or makeup wipes um i personally don't like not a big fan of the wipes but you know if you need it you can definitely use that one for i would just only time i have ever used wipes is like if i'm traveling and i really really need to feel like i need to cleanse and i have used this only time like on a road trip because i felt gross but that's the only thing that's missing from here uh, you can check out more of their products uh from target websites so they have like you know oily skin one and the glowy one so you can check them out but i will put the links to these uh down below so you can check them out as well Okay guys, so these were the products for today and I'll see you guys next week with another product. Bye guys.